Alright, how to use the peptide pen. First, we'll take off the cap. We can set the cap aside. Now you have your cartridge holder and your actual pen mechanism. We will unscrew the cartridge holder and we can grab our vial of reconstituted peptide that we've transferred over. We can put that into our cartridge holder and we will reassemble. Uh, and now uh, we'll need to get our stopper pusher up to our stop. So we'll go ahead and run it a few times. We'll see it's coming up. We'll feel just a slight pressure now. We can go ahead and just leave it, back it back in. Now you're ready to use. Now we can add our needle. Uh, you'll want to, this was uh, a real solution. You'll want to take your antiseptic wipe, clean off the pad, remove your sterile cover, screw on your needle, pull off the cap, And then we can pull off the secondary cap. And since this is the first time we've used this, we'll want to make sure that we've got all the air primed out. So I've clicked it to one, and I'll push. Okay, we got some peptide coming out. Um, then whatever your normal syringe unit would be, you'll move this to read that same number. So if you were using 10 units in your syringe, move this to 10. I'm just gonna use a potato here in this situation, but the potato would be uh, your body, whatever that might be, your abdomen, your thigh, whichever. Uh, again, you would use your antiseptic wipe, clean off a particular area, insert the needle, and push down. I'm going to rotate it so we can see. And we will push in. And your peptide has been uh, dispensed. Uh, we'll see that the doesn't necessarily like the potato very well, but it does dispense. And that's it. And we'll put on our cap, the protective cap. Unscrew our needle. Dispose of your needle properly. And you can put on your pin cap. And now you can store this uh, however you may like, probably in your fridge.